Mr. Popzilla here, checking in with my new new package from uh, from AppMax here, the Lunar Mouse. Gotta love it. I can almost taste that corn right now. Some hot butter on there. Mm. Some salt, pepper. Mm. Okay. Now this is my first coin from 2020. I'm a time traveler, as you can see. The back, man, it's like super frosty. It's frosty like a cake. Oh, man. Gotta love that. It's like gunmetal, almost. It looks like uh, high. I can't describe it, but you'll find out once you buy yourself a Luna Mouse. So I got a couple of those. Then I got my, uh, oh, that's the other one. Got my other Luna Mouse. Well, they actually, in Great Britain, they call it a rat. You're of the rat. 2020. My second 2020 coin. That is a very shiny rat. But it has the same symbol. So, I mean, mouse and rat might be interchangeable. Whatever, you see the background on that? Instead of the, uh, I guess you can't see it on here. But instead of the, uh, proof background, the shiny stuff, they put an actual matrix looking type stuff on here. You can see it? See it there? That's that's brilliant. It looks awesome. Woo! All right, the year of the raton. You're the rat or you're the mouse. You decide. It's only one year. It's not big enough for mouses and rats. Leave a comment down below. <laughs> all right, all right. But anyways, on the side note, oh yeah, oh yeah, the other lunar mouse I plan to get is the Rwanda one. The Rwanda, I think, this is the, this is last year's, the lunar pig. But they put on a good freaking coin, I'm going to tell you. The Rwanda lunar series, you really can't beat it. Uh, to me, they look beautiful. They're all fractal and uh, gorgeous, different finishes, different textures. And, uh, yep, I'm going to get an, uh, that's my other Lunar Mouse that's still in my cart over there on Atmix. The uh, Rwanda Lunar Mouse. Okay, so, oh yeah. Let's showcase my new kook. The oldest kook I have so far to this date is the old 2011. This is back when, uh, before they had three, before they had four nines over at Perth. This is a Perth round three nines fine from back in the day. The old kook. You see the, you see the brilliance on those feathers? the texture there man that's just awesome and then of course the queen y'all know the queen uh -huh. brilliant and so on a final note I wanted to put these up here and show y'all what what I got from a friend in the community Vogus Vogus for vein of gold and silver sent me these. <clears throat> yes. One tenth. One tenth of silver. One tenth. Let me get one up here so you can see. They're like a mini, uh, it's a mini, it's a mini ASE. It's a silver eagle that fits on your pinky. And they're, instead of a dime, which are one nine fine, 
These things are three nines fine. They're brilliant. Just like an exact miniature of an American Silver Eagle. I like it. It's pretty awesome. Thank you, Vogus, for supporting my channel and for being just cool in general. You the man. Love you, brother. And that's about it. Okay. I forgot. I'm gonna put I'm gonna put these. Got a little couple of packages from Three Nines Fine. These are going out to Lady B. Lady B, these are headed your way. Thanks for helping me out with my giveaway and for all your support and everything that you do in the community. Um yeah. Let me get these out in the next couple of days. And so, yep, Mr. Popzilla signing off. Stay stoked and stack on, you heard?